14th of June. Trainee Regiment Gunner. Early enlistment is the second. You wanted pilot. Does it matter? Early enlistment. <laughs> I'm not afraid. I just... I never said you were afraid. That's what you were thinking. I wasn't thinking anything. You are afraid. Is you in there? Just a minute. I need you to help me get dressed. I'll be right out. Sower's muscle is still straining, compensating for the weakness on your right. I know. Have you been off your feet? I've barely been on my feet. Have you been watching the coverage? Some of it. All of it. I know it must be difficult for you not being out there, but you've got to look after yourself. I feel pathetic. Weak. I thought I'd be better, but... I'm never going to get back out there, am I? Hola, pa. Sí. No, no, nada. Sí, no, es que hablaba porque nos dijeron que las líneas telefónicas iban a dejar de servir, entonces hablaba para ver si era cierto. Qué buena. Sí, sí, aquí estoy. Él está bien, aburrido. Ya paré de tratar de ayudarle. Papá, estoy pensando en dejarlo. Hay algo que tengo que decirte. Uh, I was probably too young for pilot. Thought you would have had more notice, to be yeah. honest. Your mum? Have you heard from him yet? Yeah.
I have to tell you something. That is why you brought me here. You have to go. Please don't hate me, just listen. You can't run, they'll just find you. If you go willingly, you can apply for home front. You might not even go overseas. And if I do? You don't have a choice. Tamron, this will affect everyone you know. Your family, my family. You might not even see combat. And if I do? Tamarin! No, are you going to turn me in? If they ask you where I am, are you going to tell them? You think it's because I'm a coward, don't you? You think it's because I don't want to go out there and fight? I don't think you're a coward, but I do think you're afraid. Yeah, you're right, I am afraid. I'm afraid of giving up my life for nothing. Mum, where's my passport? Where did you leave it? I don't know. Try the drawers in the other room, one of the top ones. Do you hate me? When your father died, I have never been so prepared for anything in my life. We knew for such a long time. When Simon died... Mum. When your brother died... It was so sudden. Simon was your favourite. It's okay. I was Dad's. It's just the way it was. He understood you far better than I do. I don't hate you, Martin. I love you. I'm just trying to prepare myself, like I did with your father. How was PCO? Fine. She said there hasn't been much improvement. I could help. You won't let me. You get angry. I get frustrated. You won't listen. Remember? I don't want you to I'm have... having a physical on Wednesday. We decided you weren't going. You decided. What about me? I'm sorry. I'm sorry that you were injured so quickly. I'm sorry that you can't be out there. I'm sorry that I remind you of all the things that you wish hadn't happened. I can't sit here doing nothing, pretending like I'm not meant to be out there. Now you know how I feel. I find you tend to hear the same things from different people. 
That bothers me. I keep saying, it's fine. It's okay. It will get easier. I hate that word now. I should probably look at time as some healing thing. It might give me some clarity, but it doesn't feel like that. I feel like everyone's lying to me. It doesn't get easier. I've just adapted to always carrying the loss around with me, um, living with it. The thing I find hardest to think about is the distance. My husband so far away. What did he think about? Did he know what was happening? Was he afraid? 